Phoenix Touch is the entry-level restoration solution from Digital Vision that combines dust busting and image repair tools for intensive, automated and manual image cleanup and retouch tasks. We're going to use an automated dust pass and then look at some of the key features in the DVO Fix tool. Features which we will see in this video include Auto Clone, the automatic repositioning and best match of surrounding frames, Rectangular Dab, operating as a rectangular brush by just clicking with a predefined sized rectangle. Visual Aids, or an overlay, providing helpful information on operating mode, as well as a host of other features designed to improve the speed of operation and enable the operator to concentrate on fixes rather than navigating the screen. On the timeline, you will notice that I have three clips with very different problems. On the first, I have lots of dust and large blotches on the frames. On the second, I have a bad frame at the end. And in the last clip, we have a punch hole running for a continuous five frames. I have a prepared note using DVO Dust and Fix, enabled and set to heavy. I'm going to select the clips and apply to all the clips on the timeline. You'll notice that rendering starts immediately upon application. And turning on the comparison mode, we always have the ability to compare fixes made with the original content so that at any stage the media can be adjusted as required. You will notice that we are left with some scratches and large blotches on the image. I'm going to use the DVO Fix tool. It is applied along with the Dust tool and we're able to use the Fix tool to fix large scratches and imperfections, but also use it to erase fixes that were made. Moving to the DVO Fix interface, we have an option to choose between a round brush or a rectangle to perform fixes and we have settings for size and brush softness. In the general tool, we have different modes for fixing material. We have auto fix, clone and auto clone modes. Under auto fix, we can use previous or next or both and set frame offsets for the tool. Similarly, in the clone, we can set clone offsets to any value but also have the option to move the clone strokes under or over the image, blur the strokes, as well as change the opacity. We can also affect the color, contrast, hue, saturation, and luminance. We can add grain to strokes using the grain tool. There is a tool to remove all the fixes from the current frame, and we also have a reveal, erase, and mix down option. Although, you should note that even mixed down strokes can be revealed and erased. We have visual aids, as an overlay, that provides helpful information on operating modes and are updated interactively from the keyboard as tools are changed. Right now I'm going to use AutoFix and the Rectangular Dab function to repair this area and go and add some grain to the fix. Moving forward, there's a big blotch on the face and I'm going to fix this using the brush. Because our tools use motion estimation, we can successfully remove spots in areas that contain motion, even if the two frames are very different. We also have a partly removed scratch, but using the rectangle tool, I'm going to remove the scratch and add some grain.
After doing any fixes, we can use our comparison tool in differential red mode to see exactly what was repaired by us and the automated filter. This way we can spot any problems and reveal any material we did not want repaired. Moving to the aircraft shot, we're just going to do a quick clone from two frames before. Remove the added grain and you'll notice a slight movement in the repair. I can easily reposition the frame to achieve the correct result. Any changes made to the frame offset will also update live in the repaired area. Our final example is the removal of a punch hole. It is in frame for five frames and we're going to use the auto fix tool to repair this. I'm going to use the offsets in the auto fix tool to allow me to automatically fix from different frames than only the previous and next ones and that will allow our automated tool to deal with issues such as these. I hope from this overview you can see the power of Phoenix Touch. Please contact Digital Vision to obtain an evaluation license to be able to explore the product further.